We're here because California has the prosperity of the eighth largest economy in the world, and we have the highest poverty rate in the country when you include housing costs. We're here because California has the highest rents, home prices, eviction rates, and mortgage foreclosures. I don't think there's anyone here in 2016 who thinks that a roof over your head should be a luxury. That is not the California dream. We are here because our state has failed to respond to this crisis. Since the Great Recession, we've cut close to $2 billion a year that used to go to affordable housing when redevelopment agencies were eliminated and housing bond funds were dried up. And while we've restored much of our social safety net since that time, we have not reinvested in affordable housing. Now is that time. As someone who lived in this state for 20 years as a tenant and chaired an affordable housing organization, I believe we have to act today. I want to thank all of my colleagues behind me. Over the past two months, we've been discussing this crisis and what we can do to respond. Today, our Assembly Democrats are proposing investing slightly over $1.3 billion in one-time funding from our budget surplus in a balanced proposal that will provide housing for working families in urban areas, for farm workers and those in rural areas, for homeless individuals, and our workforce. Investing one-time surplus funding in this area makes sense. This investment will build housing for low-income families for 55 years without an ongoing state maintenance. This investment will leverage billions of dollars of private, federal, and local investment. This investment will create jobs, 29,000 jobs for every half a billion dollars spent in affordable housing. This investment will save money, the $3,000 a month in cost for the average homeless person on the streets, in our emergency rooms, in the criminal justice system. And this investment will address poverty among Californians with the lowest 25% of incomes who spend two-thirds of their income on housing.